If you like or favorite this video before the intro is over, you can suck Max's dick. This is Max Mofo. My video schedule is as follows. Sunday is fan mail. Monday is whatever the fuck I want. Thursday is prank time, bitch. If you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, favorite it, and share it on Facebook, and I'll love you forever. Have fun, bros. Right, yeah. All right, here's that. Now get out the way now. I got this. Oh, Move God. aside. Nah, let me open no, it, No, I man. fucking get out, man. <laughs> I want to open it. Oh, fucking hell. Okay. Perry, go open this mail. I'm going to open this one. Hey, Max Mofo. Piss, shit, fuck, cunt. This is a random thing. This shit right here. Yeah. What, the, what is it? Go on. Th is this it? is Max as a giant cyborg beast with Pokemon shooting out of him. Okay, a that's true, Perry. I seriously recommend you guys check out these dudes. These, uh, this is some twins, the G twins. As I am making this video, they do not even have 30,000 subscribers. Seriously, go check them out. Go subscribe to them. Tell them that Max Mofo sent you just so they know how much traffic that this has provided them with. I'm not really asking anything from them. I just promised them I'd do this for them because I, I seriously think they deserve to be noticed. This link right here is going to go directly to a certain video of theirs and you are all going to fucking comment saying Max Mofo, something to do with Max Mofo sent me. You're going to all thumb up everyone else to say something about Max Mofo and you're going to spam the fucking page with Max Mofo. You're going to let them know what's up. You're all going to subscribe and you're going to check that shit out. Alright, now let's get into mail time. The reason why you fuckers are here. If you would like to send me mail, you can send it to this address. Let's go nuts. Everyone who's already sent mail, send mail again. I want to make the biggest fucking mail show you've ever seen. Send a hundred letters. Send fucking six thousand letters. Send twelve million letters. Everyone send as much shit as you want. You can send me whatever the fuck. You just put your cat in a box and send it. I want to get. I want to see some serious fucking boxes of cats. I want to see stacks of boxes filled with carrots with drawings of wizards playing poker on. Fuck, I don't know. Whatever you want. I just really want to see if this show could influence you to send as much shit as you can. We could make a massive show. Just for the hell of it, just once. Let's get fucking started. Max, here's a hat, please wear it. I sent Mexican candy last time, so here is some more. Here is a wonderful drawing of Totodile for my wall. And here is a hat that was sent in. Next! What the fuck, seriously? This envelope is literally just filled with air. It's, it's got nothing in it. And on the back, it's got a little thing that says entered, so I think maybe that's an entered stamp from Borders, which means that they've looked through your letter and they removed all contents of it, which <laughs> is probably because last week I said you guys could send in your severed dicks. So someone probably chopped off their dick, shoved it in an envelope and got it removed. Hey Max, love your videos, especially Terry Tips from the Funny Surnames bonus video. How the fuck did you not put that on your main channel? Woo! Look at this. Bender's getting some action. Next! Picture of a carnival in here, a Pokemon battle map and a Bill supporter trainer. Ashley has also kissed the page there, so you guys can have a kiss from her if you want. Let's fucking do this show! <sighs> True Max, I hope you like my drawing and my gift of Pokemon cards. I like Pokemon cards just like you. Sorry if these cards are fake. I also like your trolling videos from Sam Freeman. And there you go, guys. There's some Pokemon drawings there. And over here, we've got some Pokemon cards. Unfortunately, they are all fake. But thank you very much for sending those in, Sammy. Alright, guys. This next one, I'm going to be a little bit careful with because it sounds like a trick. It's a little bit rattly. I think it might be a sand bomb. So let's just gonna take a look in here. Just to, okay, so far so good. It's just a letter. But if it has sand in it or fucking shit, I'm gonna fucking kill someone. Oh, thank God for that. It's just Kool-Aid, everyone. Relax, relax. It's Kool-Aid, it's Kool-Aid. I'm gonna have to make this shit on the Saturday show sometime for sure. Hey Max, first up, do you ever stop yelling? Occasionally I do. This one is from Elliot, and thank you very much, Elliot. I appreciate your appreciation. This letter here was also opened by Australia Post. I'm not sure if they took anything, so let's hope we're all good. No items have been removed. We're all good, guys. We're all good. This one's from a user called Ham Hot Dog, and uh, he sent in this letter. It's very hard to read due to all the stuff stuck to it, but I'm going to give it my best shot. Dear Max, I have watched all your videos, and you're best, the best YouTuber ever from J... From Jay, Jay something Walker. And Jay something Walker sent in these two Max Mofo custom stickers. I'll be sure to go stick those somewhere. And this this picture of a dude wearing gum boots with a giant penis. Um, definitely get enough of those. Next. 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 Dear Max Mofo, I drew a Max version of Hello Kitty. It took fucking forever, so I hope you appreciate it, and I hope it is good enough for your amazing wall. P.S. I love you, have my babies. Here is the Max Mofo Kitty, and I can't figure out if this is supposed to be a nose or a mouth. Uh, Max Mofo $100 bill, and then we're gonna get into it! 
it. Dear Max, my fault. You are a complete asswipe who makes me fucking laugh my ass out and I fucking hate your videos because I fucking hate you. I gave you two of my fucking best cards because I have been collecting them from five years and I only gave you two because you are gay. This is this letter is very confusing. Do you hate me or do you love me? Oh, look at this little sword. I'm sorry, but I cannot open shit with these gloves. We've got two custom Pokemon cards in here. An American Express sample card and some change. Next! We've got some drawn Legend of Zelda items there. A chocolate bar and some Mario stuff. I think this is a picture of me that says Max Chicken. I don't know what the fuck that's about. Look, mate, if I was a chicken, I think I would know about it. Fucking, oh my god, I really feel like some grain. So this was Ryan. He wants a shout out to Jay, Connor, and Robert. Also, Ben, tell them that they are cool. You guys suck dick. In a cool way. Next! Dear Max, I fucking love you so much. I want to have sex with your toenails. It's a very interesting concept you have there. Next one! At first I got this book out and I was like, oh my god, you sent me a Twilight book, but it's actually a Twilight parody. It's about a vampire called Edward Mullen. Yo, yo, Max Mover, how do you do? I just thought I'd send you a whole lot of randomly interesting stuff. It says in here that this is her boyfriend's armpit hair. That, <laughs> that's good, that's good. And right here you've got this weird wand plastic stick knob thingy and the Silent Hill movie. We've got a deli bird and a horsey toy, this weird origami cool thing, and these three shiny real Pokemon cards. Oh, also this small Meowth figure and a thousand fucking meta cards. Next! This next one is a single message that says, Daniel Tira, if you are watching this, fuck you. Low jokes. Late happy birthday from Matt. Next! Shit! It's straws! Remember these? I'm gonna stick these in my bum. Hey Max, you're really, really, really funny. Keep up the video and please say hi to Lachlan Corn. But thank you for sending in this picture. It's very well made and I love when people send me artwork that's related to my prank calls. This next stripy one also says that it was entered. So let's hope nothing was removed from this either. This one says, Hello! Have you seen my dad yet? From Tessa Johnson. And attached is two lucky bands tied together. Next! Dear Maxi, I am a big fan of your videos. I have sent a picture and a pack of Pokemon cards that I got at an Asian market. Awesome. Did I ever tell you my name? Well, it's Brad. I live in Canberra. Shout out to Tedder Johnson. Well, I got a lot of Tedder Johnson letters today. We've also got a party hard Naruto in here, and thank you very much for those cards, bro. This next one is from KT. Sweet. More blue tack. Thank you, KT, but I don't think we're low at the moment. This little envelope inside the envelope with a mustache on it is labelled money. Oh, we got a $5 note. Thank you very much. That's amazing. You people do not have to send me money. I'm not extremely poor or anything. However, all the money you guys are sending me, I've been keeping in a little bag, and I'm not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. I'm thinking possibly at the end of the year I'll buy something really awesome and do a giveaway and give it away back to you guys. But I'm really not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. Maybe I'll buy something and do something for a prank to make a video. You guys can leave suggestions below. Anyway, this next little envelope inside the envelope is labelled GAMES. It also has a moustache on it. <coughs> Holy shit, we just got the three best handheld games I've ever fucking seen in my life. We've got Barbie Princess on the Game Boy Advance. We've got Hannah Montana on the DS. And also, we have Prats on the DS. Wow. Oh, fuck. I can't wait to play those. I'm sure they have some amazing content. <laughs> I can't wait to dress up Miley. This third envelope inside the envelope has a big ass mustache on it. And it says, hello, Max Mofo. Here are just some random shiz. Hope you like, love the videos. Keep up the good work from Kylie Tran. This is very nicely wrapped, by the way. Titanic. Nothing will come between them. I'm assuming that's me and Pokemon. It's also a sticker. We've also got all kinds of stickers in here. Thank you very much for that, Kylie. Yes! <sighs> More damn ponies! And some sweet old Pokemon cards from the base and jungle set. Dear Max Mofo, I hope you are well. We really like the show. Enclosed are some super handy McDonald's vouchers, as Carrie wouldn't help. And some extremely powerful and rare Pokemon cards to add to your ever-growing collection. And it's all written in Comic Sans. On purpose. Next! In here are some cards and two Pokemon scratch-off games. And this is amazing. Look at this. These are two Pokemon scratchies. I'm not sure how they work, and I'm not sure if you actually can somehow send these in to get a reward if you, if you win money or anything like that. But that's really awesome. 
I'm either gonna open these, well, open these. I'm either gonna scratch these off on the second channel Saturday show or a Pokemon show. We've also got this cool Max Mofo name tag thing in here, and he sent in this little handful of Pokemon cards, which I may add are real. This next one is from Wayne. Dear Max Mofo, I love all your videos and the effort you put into them is just amazing. Keep up the good work and keep on trolling. From Wayne, thank you very much Wayne. And Wayne has sent in this awesome Max Mofo block art, which looks really good. And now I'm moving on to the next one. <laughs> Bye Matty, could you please hang this up? That's pretty much all it says and yeah, I'll, I'll hang this up. I'll put it up over there or something like that, alright? Next! This letter is from Davey and he has sent in a water balloon, a hamburger, and a tattoo, a Yu-Gi-Oh tattoo that he drew a penis on. This next one is from Alex Jones. Dear Max Mofo, I love your videos. You're the only YouTuber who cares about your fans. I would have sent you more cards, but my mum went the devil's path and sold all of my 3,000 cards. Most from the base set. From Alex J. P.S. Try to go a whole mail time without swearing. That's a good challenge. Maybe I'll try that next time. And uh, if you guys have any challenges like that, maybe you can leave them below and I'll try to do them during mail time. Anyway, I've got a bunch of Pokemon cards here and then an Egyptian Mew as well, which is in pretty terrible condition, but that's all right. And then this little Pokemon card of things from uh, Pokemon 2000, the movie. It's like a Lugia and on the back, it's got some information. We've also got these two Yu-Gi-Oh cards, which are like Japanese. Next! This one has an obese Pikachu in it, a bear that says, yes, I do shit in the woods, and a letter that says, Max, you are funny as hell. I want to thank you for making me laugh all the time. That's no problem, mate. Next! All right, we've got a printout of a troll Pikachu and a troll face Pokemon card. No offense, but when are you guys going to stop sending these troll face Pokemon cards? I I've got enough of them. Dear Max, I hope you enjoy these pictures. Next! Dear Max, I wanted to send you something cool, but I couldn't think of anything. And then at the bottom, he's put this magnetic barcode thing that you can go stick in a shop. I uh, stick it to someone or something when they leave it, that the alarm will go off. That could make some pretty funny pranks. Next! Hey Max, I've sent you some Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I hope you enjoy. P.S. My name is Cameron and I'm from Scotland. Congratulations, Cameron. You're from Scotland. We've got the Yu-Gi-Oh cards here. Most on the front are real, but we've got some fake ones when we get into the pack. And look at this one. This pretty much just looks like an underwater Batman. Seriously. Look at this one. What a beautiful brown little package. That's what your mum said last night. Dear Max, you are the most fucking funny guy on YouTube. I stayed up all night last week watching your videos. We've got this cool little Kingdom Hearts cross Pokemon, cross Dragon Ball Z, cross Naruto drawing in here. A bunch of random crap and a Rooney card. You know what, actually, that should be with a pile of crap. But cool Scooby-Doo game, bro. Next! Dear Max, I hope you like the cards. Well, all right, let's see what we've got here. Okay, we've got fake Digimon cards, we've got fake Yu-Gi-Oh cards, and we've got fake Pokemon cards. Thank you anyway. Next! This one just has a bunch of Pokemon cards in it. All these are fake, but uh, this McDonald's one is not. This next one is from Andy Pringle in Canada. <laughs> <laughs> Give me the dick. Hi Max Mofo, I told you that I would send you a tin full of cards, but that was $50 Canadian and I'm cheap. So instead, I will give you my very best cards. These are for your birthday, so happy birthday. Thank you very much for those, Andy. He also wants a shout out to his cousin. That's her YouTube channel there because she got him into my videos. Now, we've got some extremely amazing Pokemon cards here. Uh, he sent in all these hollows here. And if you look over here, we've got these three, which are, no, there's four. We've got four primes. Those are fucking awesome. Look at those. I'm definitely putting all these on the Pokemon channel. And in here, we've got a Legends card, which is fucking rare as shit. This next one... Ah! Fucking hell. This next one here is another letter that says, Hello, have you seen my son, Teta, from Mark Johnson? Well, Mark Johnson, he wrote in earlier, so I can't really tell you where he is, but he's looking for you as well. This next one is from Josh. Dear Max Mofo, my name is Josh Brody. You might remember me from Facebook, specifically on the Nicki Minaj post. I love your videos and I really want your hair. Haha, <laughs> I used to have long hair, but everyone said I looked like a girl. Well, you know, you're always going to get that from some people. And on the back is a colourful drawing of a Zubat. We have three bits of mail left now. Hey Max, we sent you this Pokemon pack and an awesome near mint condition card. It would be awesome if, it would be awesome if you could open the pack on the mail show and not the Pokemon channel, please. Alrighty, but I'm going to tell you uh, this pack. I'm not saying I can tell fake packs, because that's getting a little bit technical, but um, if you can look down here, you can see that the print is slightly off, like it's been printed uh, badly. But we're going to go straight into these, and don't say I told you so, but if this is fake Pokemon cards, I told you so. And I told you so. First up, we've got this. This is an extremely fake Pokemon card. It's one of these 
gravelly ones. Very disgusting. Uh, if you turn to the back of these, these are all fake. As I was saying, you can get these booster packs with the, you can tell that they've got a bit of a bit of a ghosty print and you get them from usually Asian markets and stuff like that. But thank you for these real individual ones that you sent in and this near mint whale lord EX which has been stuck back together a fucking lot. By the way, we sent you a hot pepper. If you can eat it and spit out without drinking, we will seriously send you a hundred dollars. Don't worry, it's not dangerous. Well, it looks like a shivered up tomato, but maybe I'll do this for a challenge video for a Monday video or something like that. Maybe on the second channel. Let's see. The second last one here is from Callum. And yeah, it's a package inside a package again. And hey, Max, my name is Hamp182 and I'm from Rockingham. Anyway, if you haven't checked the package yet, I have gotten you some party toys, Pokemon cards. I know that at least one of them is fake and a small pick. Hope to see you at the 2013 Supernova. See ya, Hamp182. All right, we got this Freddo Frog school pack thing, this crazy beetle, this weird, what the fuck is this, okay? A penguin, I mean, a, a snowman glow in the dark jumbo glow stick. Some very cheap board game thing, and this one of these little jittery ball games. We've also got this Pokemon black and white coin, and then this envelope right here, which I think has the Pokemon cards in it. What the hell, another coin. Max Bobo. All right, we've got quite a lot of the online codes here from Booster Packs, and then obviously a lot of these, a lot of Pokemon cards here, there's some fake in there, but they're mostly all real, so thank you very much for those. All right, guys, we're on to the last one. It's a box. It's got, ah, fuck that sound. It's got sticky tape on it, and if this is sample mail, I'll fucking hit myself in the face with the box. <laughs> Okay, I don't know if these are sample mail, but we've got these three just books, best sellers apparently. Oh, bit of an anticlimactic ending again. We always do this, seriously. All right, guys. I just had a genius idea. If you guys record videos of yourself saying, welcome to the Sunday show, if you like and favorite this video before the intro is over, and blank, 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 blank I will put you, I'll take your video and I'll use it on each Sunday show. I'll pick someone each Sunday show. So you come up with your own little thing there, like, and I'll do this, like, just pretend you're me. Say, and I'll, I'll cut your dick off, something appealing that people are going to go, holy shit, I better like and favorite this before the intro is over. Because that's pretty much become a thing on the mail show. And if you guys uh, do that, leave Max Mofo as a tag on that video, upload it to YouTube, and you may be the lucky person that gets to do the intro for the Sunday show. Hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you next Sunday. Very good acting. <laughs> Sam Asal named his crash repair business Lord of the Dings nine years ago for a laugh. But in the last two months, it's been beyond a joke. Not funny at all, no. It's, it's killing us in the business. His Elizabeth workshop is bombarded up to 40 times a day with prank calls. One has gone viral, already getting almost 200,000 hits on YouTube. Lord of the Dings, yeah. that is a f horrible name. <laughs> oh, fucking sample mail bullshit! Ow! And if you guys want to see Fan of the Week, just click this box!